morning everybody today is our first day back at vlogging i just filmed the long intro so you'll most likely see that in its own video if not it'll have been in front of this one but today is monday today we have a lot of stuff to do so i need to all the kids have school first and foremost i'm making lunches that's why i'm doing this hands-free um i have huh what yeah you're gonna get to go to school um, Trevor, please don't stand with the refrigerator open. So, uh, I'm making lunches and snacks. Yes, something I should have done last night, but I made the mistake of sitting on the couch last night and therefore got nothing done. Um, I'm pretty, I think I've done all my grocery shopping that I'm going to need to do, uh, on my to-do list. There's just, you know, finish out the meal plan for the meal plan for the rest of the, or for the party. Uh, Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. I know I do need to run to Costco and get some pastries and stuff, but that will be done before, um, like, that'll probably be done on Wednesday or maybe Thursday morning. We'll see. I, I really don't want to be driving down there on Thursday morning. Um, but today I have some areas in my house I want to clean. I need to call and reschedule. I had made an appointment for the cat to go to the vet tomorrow, and I just, I'm not going to have time, um, so I want to reschedule that for after the new year when things die down a little bit now where Ellie is in school a couple days a week. I can really, I've been really using that time pretty wisely um, so I can do stuff like that. All right, so for my to-do list today, I need to go to the UPS store to send something back. I need to go to the post office. I have a meeting at Trevor's school. Um, I have to call the vet. I have to finish making some peanut butter cookies that the dough is in the refrigerator that I made um, this weekend. Um, and then I need to assemble a goodie platter for my husband's work. Um, I have fudge made. I'll have some of those peanut butter cookies. Uh, I don't know. what I have some bark left I can throw in there. So hopefully that'll be enough. If not, I may need to make like one more thing for that. I need to grab two tablecloths before they're all gone for our main table because I burnt it the other day when I was baking. And then for the other table, which is either going to be, I'm undecided if I'm going to put everything out on my counters and use that table in here and actually put all the presents on it. Um, where you've seen my mom, we've, we've had this discussion on how my mom like really overdoes it and um, it's hard to find a place to put all the presents. Um, I need to be wrapping at night. Um, I have, I mean, I have presents for my mom, my husband. I have a couple left for the kids, um, teachers, all that type of stuff. Um, I need to put away all the laundry that I have folded and then keep doing laundry throughout the day. I need to organize my walk-in room so that if we need to, we can put stuff down there in a temporary spot. Um, I want to clean my living room and my living room closet. Make sure I set aside the kids' jammies um, that they're going to wear on Christmas Eve so that they'll stay set aside. Um, kids' Christmas. Oh, I need to wrap, have Aubrey and Ellie wrap the presents they bought for Trevor or for their, you know, secret Santas or whatever, and then I need to clean my playroom, organize my playroom, throw out anything else that's broken or, you know, that needs to be out of here. So I have a rather long to-do list. Um, I'm hoping that I can get a lot of stuff done this morning when they're at school, and then as soon as I get back, I have all the stuff at home. Oh, and I have to empty out my car of my mom's presents. All right, so my meeting is done, and it ended up turning into two meetings, and it you know, I just, we're at a complete and utter loss. It's been about a year now of dealing with all of these behavioral issues with Trevor and we've gone through every route. You know, we have him in therapy and it's just hard. It's really hard. It's really hard when you know that this isn't what your kid wants to do. You know that you have a really good kid, but he's just making some really bad and stupid decisions. And um, unfortunately, you know, you have to make them pay for them. You have to make them... Um, lose privileges and stuff like that so for now he's actually taken off the bus he was actually suspended off of the bus um kind of a, a soft suspension you know the the bus driver would have let him stay on but I said you know what he can take it in the morning because I truly can't get him there in the morning and I'll take him in the evening um so uh we're working on getting him coded and you know stuff like that but it's just a lot of disrespect you know he doesn't really disrespect me or my husband. He doesn't disrespect his teacher. But anyone who's like, who doesn't know him, he disrespects. Um, or someone that he doesn't see on a regular basis, his bus driver, things like that. So it's been very difficult, um, very hard. Um, 
you know, that's kind of why I haven't been daily vlogging for vlog days because um, we have some rough days. We have some really rough days that he's been stealing from me. Um, you know, it's not anything that you want to share, but I think that, and I'm hoping to share this in hopes that, you know, um, someone else, maybe it helps. You know, I know that it's funny. Everyone says, you know, he was on, never on even on the radar. And then all of a sudden it's bad behavior on a day to day, -day basis. So, um, yeah, so I went and got myself two donuts and a coffee because that's the kind of day I'm having. But, um, I scratched a couple things off my list. I think I'm going to go and see if I can get my nails done. Um, no, I probably shouldn't be. I probably should be doing other things, but I am just so like, I just kind of need to like unwind from all those meetings. I spent an hour in meetings and then of course I had to take Ellie to school late, which is not fair to her. It's not fair at all that, you know, she has to go to school 30 minutes late because I'm dealing with this. And you know, that's, that's kind of the state that we're in that, you know, we're having to put all hands on Trevor and it's not fair to the other kids who are so well behaved and never disrespect anyone and do so well in school and stuff like that. So, um, I'm going to go get my nails done to unwind, maybe grab some tablecloths, but if not, uh, after I pick up Casey, we'll go and run some errands real quick. I just need to get, like, just a couple things, and um, then we can be home, and I can do, you know, the cleaning and chores and stuff, so uh, not super deep cleaning where I've just got my nails done, but this is, like, the only day, because this is Ellie's only day of school this week since Thursday is Christmas Eve. All right, so we... Our home, it's much lighter in the day. I won't even lie, in all honesty, I came home and I sat and I thought, like, should I just bother not vlogging anymore? Like, you know, who's gonna wanna see this? Who's gonna really wanna see, like, the just downward slide that's gone on? And um, I talked to a few friends and, you know, we're gonna make some changes. I'm gonna have to stop um, babysitting, hopefully temporarily, because um, you know, me babysitting is so good for Casey. Um, obviously it's good for me, uh, financially. Uh, it's, you know, good to help a friend who can get, you know, a super discounted, uh, child care rate and know that I'm a friend of hers and, you know, I love her daughter like my own children. Um, but I just feel that right now I'm constantly like on edge and um so you know me just having any extra distractions away is probably best for me and the kids um I even debated canceling Disney because I just don't know if that's gonna happen anymore with everything going on but um so I came home so I came in after getting all the kids and I cleaned up the living room all the pillows are behind the couch I'll put those out like closer to Christmas, but um, like sucked everything. I'm gonna get the rest of the presents up here tonight as well. Um, like dusted everything, all that stuff. And then um, went through the kids stuff. I need to bring up their Christmas books so they have something to deal with. But tomorrow we can finally go to the dump. So I'm gonna have the kids get all this trash downstairs. Um, we have a ton of trash on our deck and then um, just like quickly, you know, clean up this little area, sweep the floors, um, clean up my countertops, make their lunches, and do these dishes. Um, and then, Santa. I have to walk tonight. I have to do Jeff stocking. Uh, I need to find all the kids Christmas jammies that my mom bought them so that we have those all set for Christmas Eve. Um, I'm gonna move the kids Christmas wrapping to tomorrow. Yes. Aubrey and Ellie need to wrap the boys presents yes, and then you do the walk-in room and I put away all this so. laundry. So I'm just gonna try to get See? my list done and all the stuff. My husband just called to let I'm me know that he's working late. So I'm gonna do something easy for dinner like macaroni and cheese or something um, and just try to get a lot of this stuff done. I'm working on Christmas gifts for the teachers. So these are, I have Casey's and Trevor so far because Aubrey got sent to bed. Um, so I'm putting a Mrs. Myers and one of these and a little tag that says we wash you a Merry Christmas and then I should have a, yeah. And then a $5 gift card and I'm just wrapping it up in cellophane um, with a card. And then the bus drivers are going to get a soap with um, some ribbon wrapped around it that says we wash you a Merry Christmas. Um, and then 
um, all the aides and therapists are going to get candy canes. And if I have enough candy canes, then the bus drivers will get a big candy cane too. But we'll see. Well, all those are done. Um, happy with that. As soon as the dishwasher is done, I'm going to unload it and load those dishwash dishes in and then put all my stuff away. Um, looking at my list for today, uh, the only thing I didn't get done was like the playroom and stuff like that and then go to UPS. So what I think I'm going to do is actually sit down for a minute and then probably go downstairs and play in the playroom so that maybe I can do a little bit of wrapping. Um, but like I can scratch off the teacher gifts that I did. Um, and my room is almost clean. I could actually probably do that too. And then I'll have made some pretty good progress for the day. And then tomorrow will be, I'll be home more. Um, you know, I'll obviously have to take Trevor and Aubrey and everyone to school except for Ellie. But, um, we'll be home most of the day. So I shouldn't need, um, anything else but I do need to get a couple more M&Ms but I think my husband's going out tonight so I'm going to ask him if he will grab me a couple of these little uh, candy canes because these are perfect for the kids teachers um, or like Casey's Casey just has a ton of like therapists and stuff so that's all for his team I'm debating if I want to get them I normally get something for like the PE teacher the computer teacher the art teacher the librarian and I think that's it for specials and like Trevor also has French but then that's another ten dollars I'm gonna be spending so I probably will get him but I'm just having that inner battle with myself that's as clean as it's gonna get I even moved our little park phone thing and just put my <coughs> dresser there but I just have to fix the bed in the morning but I'm obviously not doing that now so now I'm gonna go downstairs and work in our storage room all right so now I'm gonna work in this room which is like just a mess of stuff and it always gets this way like I have to go to the dump tomorrow so the trash has to stay there but uh, I'm gonna try to get this as picked up as I can because um my mom got the kids some big stuff for Christmas and it's gonna have to get stored in here so I just truly don't even know where we're gonna put stuff because like my husband has like stuff all along the walls we have stuff up on the refrigerator we have stuff up here I just don't know where it's gonna go and I need to pull everything out but I need to wrap <laughs> I was doing so good and then we went on vacation and that just screwed me <laughs> well this is as good as this is gonna get cleaned up all that I moved that stacked the strollers there brought our old perk station down all that trash is going tomorrow I'm gonna throw that bag of feed to the chickens that just has to go into our little room for the cat uh, we have like no extra sodas or anything so I probably should get some of those for the party. This stuff will all be organized after the holidays. Um, I think that's stuff the girls got for the boys. There's Christmas presents there. The Christmas presents in that bin. And this is like our other storage room. And this has like all of our clothing and stuff in it. And then like my husband's selling stuff because he sells a lot of car parts. And then like <laughs> this is stuff I put here. Like as we are going through it like clothes that stop fitting the kids or whatever that we're saving goes there and then this is the current state of my office I have stuff like everywhere that I need to take care of as well as stuff in that little area right there and I had cleaned up the TV room today and then Trevor was down here playing so I think tomorrow my main goal is going to be to wrap and get the basement cleaned up